So traditionally, drones in the security space have either been overly complex, too expensive, or just basically too hard to implement until now. DJI have, have released a solution that makes bringing a drone into security simple and easy to use at a price point that can be widely adopted. The challenge the Dock 2 was designed to overcome was even with the autonomy that drones uh, have, they always required a pilot on site. The Dock 2 was designed to allow remote operations. So anywhere you have an internet connection, uh, you can connect that to the Dock 2 and then you're able to access that uh, dock or that drone. Essentially what that means is the Dock 2 can be controlled from a remote monitoring center, can be controlled from someone's office, anywhere they have internet access, it can be controlled from the passenger seat of a vehicle. So imagine the possibilities of having a movable security camera, an eye in the sky that you can access from anywhere in the world. So the Dock 2 uh, has two drone options, uh, the M3TD being the thermal variant, which is better suited for security applications. So it has a 10 kilometer flight rate, the thermal camera with up to 28 times digital zoom. And you also have a 48 megapixel wide camera and a 12 megapixel telecamera. Do you have to use DJI software? Uh, the answer is no. There is multiple third party software for example, Flightbase, this is a software that you can run on your own external servers and allows you to connect to external third-party VMS systems like your Genetech and Milestone software. Since the Dock 2 is designed to be out in the elements, it's very rugged, uh, it's weatherproof, it's IP55 rated. It also has internal heating and cooling, so it, it makes it a very versatile unit that can be utilized in a large variety of applications. It also has this, an inbuilt rain and weather sensor, so it knows the conditions on site and will give you a warning if, say, the conditions are too harsh to fly the drone. So what's the level of autonomy in the Dock 2? You can set up predetermined routes, so you can have patrols set up autonomously. They can be triggered to go off at certain times. They can also be triggered from certain events. You can link, say, motion sensors or a CCTV cameras can trigger events where autonomous missions um, are undertaken or even as simple as it triggers the drone to take off and put the camera on a certain location. So lots of autonomy built in. Essentially what that means is that the operator is essentially only there to make sure that something doesn't go wrong. So if you'd like to know more, um, please feel free to reach out to us at EE Group. We are the exclusive distributor for DJI Enterprise products here in Australia and we'll welcome the chance to come out to show you how you can utilize the DJI Dock 2 in your security application or with your clients. Uh, just contact me at the email and phone number listed at the bottom of the screen.